everybody from the back, tell me what problem we're solving. Does this look like yours? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Okay, so we're going to, first thing we're going to do is we're going to change our subtraction problem so that when we're taking away we have no zeros, right? So this one's tricky. Oh my gosh, this one is very tricky. There are two ways we can go with this. Yeah, when I look at the 5 and I need to round it to the nearest 10, it's right in the middle. What's one of my options? Up so give down. me one option. You can go up. To what? 10. Okay, but what would the new number be? 500. I could either add 5 and get 400. What's my other option, Brayden? I could take away 5 and get 390. Which do you think would make our jumps a lot easier? Why do you think 400, Hema? <coughs> a lot smaller jumps, huh? How many jumps would I do if I went to 400? Just 400. Just 400s, no 10s and no 1s. How many jumps would we have to do if we did 390? 300 and 9 tens, that makes 12 jumps. Which way should I go? 400. 400. Thumbs up if you agree, 400. Okay, we got a couple that didn't agree, but want, want. You're going to do it with us anyway, okay? Here we go. Um, 395 plus 5 equals 400. 823 plus 5 equals... Eight hundred and twenty-eight minus four hundred. Oh my gosh, this is going to be so easy. The first step. What's my first rule when I'm subtracting? Jock, please get this on your paper. Sit up. Jock. Tell me, Anna. Label first. Which one am I going to label? Four hundreds. What am I going to label it like? H goes to the top of the four. T goes to the top of the second zero. Oh, why can't I put it under the first zero? Because that's the one's place. Thank you. But you said zero, so I was just going to put it on a zero. That's very important. Okay. Okay. Now, um, what did I not do yet, Janaya? <coughs> I have to circle the highest value so I remember which number to use. What happens when some of you guys aren't circling the highest value is you're labeling this number and jumping this number and taking away from this number. This would not be correct. Because it would get us back to zero. That would not help us at all, would it? Okay, so when we circle the highest value, that tells us what number we're going to start with, correct? Yes. All right. What number are you going to start with? 828. 828. Here's my number line. There's my starting spot. Has everyone got their number written under their starting spot? Yes. yes. Not everyone. That's why I'm asking. Trent? Yes. 828. Yes. I want us to focus up here, please. All right, now, uh, Michael, I forgot. What am I doing next? You're supposed to put 400 jumps. Okay, here I go. One, two, three, four. Do I need to worry about 10 spaces, space for the 10s and the 1s on this one? No. I don't need to worry. I have all this space and I can, as long as I can see my numbers, I want my jumps to be big enough so I can read them, right? Trent, how many hundred jumps are you going to draw? Mm -hmm. Please do it. Alright, you guys, this is going to be so easy. You guys are going to be like, Miss G, that one was too easy and then you gave us hard ones to do by ourselves. Girl, I say. Here we go, ready? 
the eight in front is changing, not the eight in the ones column. Minus, ooh, 100. No one said, Miss G, label your jump. Miss G, let me jump. Oh, thank you, my mom. Never forget. Thank you, my Trent. Okay, got him. Here we go. 827, take away 100 equals? 800. I can't understand when all of you are saying different things. 728, thanks. Um, Tyler, I love how you raised your hand there. If when I'm at 728 and I take away another hundred, what number am I going to get? 628. 628. Okay, Lucas, I'm going to come to you. Not this next jump, but in two jumps. Be ready. Okay. Um, Julian, yes. which number is going to change now? Six. Still the six? Okay. Why? Still the Kiss your brain. Still going to change the 6 because it's still the 100. 600 minus, 628 minus 100 equals? 528. Okay, here's Lucas's turn. Lucas, 528. I'm changing 100 still. 500 minus 100. What's going to be my answer? 428. Kiss your brain. 428. How do I know that's correct? You no. check it. How? Um, partial sum. Partial sums addition, right? So we've got 428 plus the original subtrahend, the original takeaway number, which is 300, 9 tens, and 5 ones, plus, this is going to get a little messy. I think I need to slide it down. Okay, 428. You guys already have your chart. Ones, tens, and hundreds. Okay, so can I start adding at the hundreds? No. Please don't start at the hundreds. I know some of you like to go left to right because that's what we do when we read. But when we're adding, we have to go right to left. We have to go backwards. So, Mr. Hamsley, can you help me? Yeah. What's 8 plus 5? Um, Trent, start at 8. Trent. Trent, look at Miss G. 8, 9, 13. The three goes under the five, the one goes under the nine. Are there any hundreds in the number 13? No. So I'm going to put a zero to hold that place. Because we've got three digits. We want three digits in our number. So zero 13 is the same as just 13. Tima, next I'm adding 20 plus 90. 11 what? 11 tens. Can I put my 11 here in the tens and the ones column? No. no, that's why we need to know it's 11 tens. What else do we call 11 tens? Guys in the back? 110. 110. You are so close. That's a big difference though. This is 101. This is 110. We want the, the ones in both the tens column and the hundreds column. 90, 100, 110. Right? Zamiya. Four hundreds plus three hundreds. Seven hundreds. Seven hundreds. The zero is holding its place in the tens and the ones, right? <coughs> Go ahead and look. One hundred and ten because ninety plus twenty is one hundred and ten, and then seven hundred because three hundred plus four hundred is seven hundred. Now we. Add down, add the chicken, right? Leftovers. Oh, Three plus zero plus zero is? Three. Three. One ten plus one ten is? Two, two tens. tens. And one hundred plus seven hundred is? Eight. 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 Now, if we're right, this eight twenty-three is going to match the first number on the board. Yes. Were we right? Yes. Yeah. Check. Yep. Good job.